Highland Fling. It can travel at up to 10 knots and welcome six guests in three cabins, with one double and two with bunk beds. It has a double helm, masts by Southern Spars, and a rail area of 440 metres squared, provided by North Sails. It is impossible not to see the picture of this thistle on the sail, which is also called the Guardian, and is the flower emblem of Scotland. In fact, according to legend, in the year 1000, whilst the Scottish soldiers were sleeping in their camps, several Vikings landed and took off their boots in order not to make any noise and wake up their enemies. They did not take into account the fact that there would be spiky thistles there. The shouts of the Danish woke up the Scots who had time to prepare to fight and win the battle against their adversaries. And that is why the Scottish standards you often see the thistle linked to a Latin motto, which when translated means, no one will have challenged me with impunity. Another interesting fact is that the Scottish rugby players are also called the Thistles, and the anthem Flower of Scotland has been the official Scottish anthem adopted by the Scottish Rugby Union to replace God Save the Queen. Getting back to the Highland Fling, it was the same owner, Laidlaw, who wanted the best racing boat. And results? Highland Fling was up on the podium for the Loro Piana Super Yacht Regatta in 2011 in the performance category and in Portocurvo's Maxi Yacht Rolex Cup in 2012 in the racing category.